Hey, hey, how's it going? If you're new here, my name is Jam and I love makeup. And if you're not new, thanks for coming back. I really appreciate you. Today's video is going to be um, kind of a, what I would like to purchase when I'm actually going to purchase from the Sephora VIB sale. Things I think that are worth it and maybe things I wouldn't necessarily grab. So I figured I could show you what's in my cart that I would <laughs> like to be in my possession and we could just go from there. So that's what this is gonna be. If you're not subscribed to my channel already, now is a great time to do that. I upload four videos a week, Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. If you click on the bell and choose all, YouTube will notify you when I upload a new video. You can choose to watch it or not, it's totally up to you, no pressure. All right, let's just get into it. been working on a Sephora cart for probably a little over a month. I knew the VIB sale was coming at some point and I tend to choose things and put them in my cart and leave them there until I decide to actually pull the trigger and purchase the stuff. The thing that's been in my cart the absolute longest is the Selena Gomez Rare Beauty Bronzer Stick. It has gone in and out of stock a bunch of times as of right now it's still in stock and I plan on grabbing the shade uh, Always Sunny. I think that will work as a bronzer for my skin when I'm as tan as I am now and hopefully as I get tanner in the summertime. I'm also considering picking up a new Jouer bronzer duo. I mentioned in a couple of videos that mine did not survive the trip home from vacation and is smashed into itty bitty pieces and I really like that bronzer, so I think I might repurchase it. Um, I haven't said yet. The sale is 20% off, 15% off, or 10% off, depending on where you fall in the VIB lineup. I get 20% off because I'm a rouge, because I buy a lot of makeup. Um, so 20% off something that I love is a pretty good deal. Another thing I'm thinking about grabbing is a second uh, shade in the Glowish Bronzer line they have it in a mini size for $17 in the shade deep tan and I have 03 light tan now and I'm actually wearing it today and it's really just not dark enough and um, I'm tan from vacation and it's fading so I know that in the summertime the tan light that I have isn't going to work so 20% off and I really like mini sizes because I have so much makeup I'm never gonna go through it all so when I can get a mini size it just feels like a smarter option for me personally. A definite going in my cart and coming home with me is the Briogeo Scalp Revival Charcoal Coconut Oil Micro, Exfoli Micro Exfoliating Scalp Scrub Shampoo. I love that shampoo. I use it every few weeks, every couple of weeks usually uh, to exfoliate and really clean my scalp and my roots. So I'm almost out of that. If I can get it for 20% off, that'll make me happy. I also want to try two foundations. I love trying foundation. I don't know why. I haven't tried the uh, NARS Soft Matte Complete Foundation. So I think I'm gonna grab that. And I've been hearing a lot of really good things about the Sephora brand Best Skin Ever Foundation. So I think I wanna grab that one as well. Again, 20% off. Feels like the right time to try some new foundation. My most favorite foundation is the Lisa Eldridge perfect skin or whatever it's called. That's amazing, but not 20% off. So we'll wait on that one. Another thing that's been in my cart for quite a while, pretty much since its release, is the Danessa Myricks Infinite Chrome Flakes. That just seems really cool and interesting. And I love her blush palette. So if you don't have it and you were thinking about it, now would be a good time to get it. I have the pinky orange one and I love it until now, it has completely satisfied my need for blush. And I have a drawer full and I love, love, love that palette so much. It's so good. And then I really wanna try the I'm Still Here Long Wear Clean Matte Liquid Lipstick by Gwen Stefani. The eyeshadow palettes really don't interest me because they are very neutral and I have plenty of neutral eyeshadow. So I'm not gonna go for that, but a red lip, I can't resist that. The last two things I have in my cart are Sephora brand blushes. I have the shade 16 Heated and 17 Hey Jealousy. 
again, I really like blush. I really like all the makeup. Who am I kidding? But I've heard really good things about the Sephora stuff recently, so I thought I would try a couple of those. One is, of course, orangey, and one is, of course, pink, so that would be pretty fun. I definitely don't think a sale means you have to go out, you have to buy stuff because there's a sale. That's silly, and no one should do that. But because I've had stuff in my cart and, you know, the shampoo, I really need to restock. For the last sale, I picked up the hair oil that I really, really like. Um, it's a good time to replace things that you use on the reg and maybe try some new stuff. So obviously my cart isn't huge. I'm not going to go crazy. I'm one person and I have a giant makeup collection for one person. So I want to get some new stuff and play, but I'm not going to go nuts. So I would love to hear if you are participating in the sale, what you're thinking about picking up. Have I talked to you in anything? Hopefully if I did, it's because you really, really wanted it and not FOMO because that's silly. It's going to be there. So I guess that's it. This was a lot shorter than I thought it was going to be. I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Let me know in the comment section what you think and if you're going to purchase things. I'm very interested to hear. All right, that's it. Be good and remember to be kind to you.